Investigators in Thailand have made a surprising find. The thrust reverser on Flight 4's left engine is fully deployed. Once we actually saw that the thrust reverser had deployed, for me, it was, it was shocking. It was not anything I really expected would happen. Thrust reversers help jetliners come to a stop on landing. They work by redirecting engine thrust forward to slow the plane down. Left side deployed in midair. No doubt. Planes have built-in safeguards to prevent reversers from deploying during flight. But even if it does happen, it shouldn't cause a crash. In fact, flight testing has already shown exactly that. Before the 767 first went into service, Boeing had to prove that pilots could keep flying safely after a mid-air deployment. There was a lot of vibration, a lot of noise, but the airplane was controllable. The pilots only experienced a small loss of lift. As a result, Boeing certified the 767 as capable of continued safe flight and landing under any possible position of the thrust reverser. But the discovery of an engine with a deployed reverser is so unusual, investigators must conclude that it's somehow related to the crash. How does a thrust reverser bring down a 767? We're missing something. If it turns out that a faulty thrust reverser can bring down a plane, it has ominous implications for the entire airline industry. The lives of hundreds of thousands of passengers around the world could be in jeopardy. We recognized that we had something that was uh, very unusual and would, uh, would require a lot of analysis. The deployed thrust reverser is the strongest lead investigators have. But no one can figure out how it could have caused the crash. Investigators will have to solve the mystery without their most valuable tool. The flight data recorder is so badly burned that technicians at the NTSB can't recover any data. But there's better news about the cockpit voice recorder. It has survived the fire. Ready to go. The voice recorder shows a normal takeoff and climb. Lending gears up. All this kind of normal communication, which I knew all the people. <clears throat> so for me, it was honestly hard. This was the hardest part of all my life. We are clear to level 310 and maintaining louder four. Flight four climbs to 7,000 feet without a problem. A little more than five and a half minutes into the flight, the first hint of trouble. Chase it. Keeps, uh... Let's come on. What's come on? Some kind of warning. The pilots have noticed an alert that's coming on in the cockpit. Could this be the clue that unlocks the mystery of Lauda Flight 4? <laughs> 